a look at this storm. It's riding to the north. It's going to be pushing up close to the South Carolina coast. Let's take you there with Mike Seidel. And fortunately, Jennifer, this uh, storm is going to stay far enough away from the coast to uh, leave us basically unscathed here in the Charleston Folly Beach area. And with the worst of the storm, even east of the center, uh, about all we're going to get here is maybe some rain and some wind, and that will be about it. We do expect a second landfall later on tomorrow in North Carolina. Exactly what happens on a day when hurricane warnings go up here in Folly Beach? Well, we looked around, and this is what we found. This is his first major storm. No, Hugo was before my time. Yeah, 15 years ago, uh, makes me feel old. General manager here at the hotel tells me that about 45 rooms checked out early, but they fill those rooms with people coming in for the weekend because the weather will turn around very nicely. The sun will be back out probably tomorrow afternoon, and the weekend right now looks thumbs up. Often the case following a tropical storm or hurricane. Again, mandatory evacuations up around Myrtle Beach, uh, east of Highway 17. Otherwise, we should be okay for most of this area here in the Low Country. All right, thanks so much. Mike Seidel again along the coast of South Carolina where the severe weather threat could increase.